how to submerge your servo there we go it's in the water now you can see the wheel turning and it's all submerged Basically the servo was um, dismantled, uh, silicon grease was applied round the horn inside the plastic cover on the top plate and it was reassembled and put back. And then the servo was coated on the joins with CA glue and on the battery part where it comes out of the servo at the bottom. I use CA glue but really um, that's a soluble based glue so um, silicon, aqua sil silicon would be a better medium to use and then it was just a case of painting the body with the um, Plasky dip and it's basically a liquid plastic paint and you have to give it two coats um, four hours in between each coat and that makes it totally waterproof and as you can see submerging Let's just take this off a bit There we go, and that's it. Now here we have um, a standard small motor. I think it's a 350 or something like that. Just a small standard motor. And this measuring jar here it's just filled with um, distilled water because that's clean water there'll be no particles in it and so the motor can be emerged in the water and turned on and this motor will work while submerged 